Hi there, I'm FaZe, and we're going back to the fight. The good fight, people. Three dog. All right. If you remember last time, we kept fighting these guys here, and we kept on getting our asses kicked. And by we, I mean me, but I'm using we in order to sort of shift blame off of myself and blame you, the viewing public. This is called being a douche nozzle. Okay, I'm gonna kill them both right now. Like, oh, look at that. Oh! Owned! The Impact! What, you're on the floor? <laughs> Bad news for you, guy! Being prone does not automatically make you immune to bullets. I learned that the hard way once. You're wondering what the hard way is? I was prone and I got shot to death. Anyway, just gonna crawl under here. This is the third time I've seen this puddle and it's starting to get repetitive. So what I'm gonna have to do is this. Ah! Pow to pow pow. Pow pow. Two down. And back behind this dumpster. You see, slow motion, very, oh god. Slow motion, very helpful, but not, not, ah, ah, I feel like I'm in the matrix. Ha, didn't even scratch me, I think. Oh god, there he is again. And, Oh god! Oh man! There goes the lining of my small intestine. Ah! I kinda liked that thing. Oh my! Dog! Uh, Z. Oh wow. Okay. I'm doing better this time, still. And, ah! Uh, ah, uh, no! No running away! I don't get to run away, so you don't get to run away. That's the rules. Follow the rules, or get shot in the back of the head. That That's pretty much the Geneva Convention right there. Hmm. What? Right, so I'm not going up there. Oh, checkpoint in midair. Like it. Again, I feel like we're missing out on the crucial... Oh! Ghost aspect. That's what I was talking about. Ah! Oh. I guess this is sort of like a cutscene. He dissolves into that black mist stuff. Right. You know, I like ghosts, but I sort of like my ghosts in the busting variety. I'm a ghost buster after all. Oh, there he is again! This is the guy we're looking for, right? He just keeps disappearing. Oh. Okay, talking to me. That's nice. Room full of dead bodies. I'm going this way. Because if I see a bunch of dead bodies in a room, I sort of anticipate boss fight. Ah! I like that. I like that a lot. Anyway, I'm anticipating a boss fight. Or a ghost. Ghost! What, just dead guys? D damn it, I've been seeing dead guys all day. What I haven't been seeing is me fighting a frickin' ghost. What's the point of being a supernatural army thing if you don't fight a single ghost, just a bunch of clones? Oh, look, ghost! Aha! Uh, oh, wow. 
Um, I have a feeling this is one of those runaway ghosts. Oh, man. Oh. Wait. Am I jumping through the window? D damn it, game. I would have liked if you would let me do that part. See, that's the sort of thing I want to do. Jump through windows, kick people in the face, and fight ghosts. Ah. Do-do-do. Alright, we're going back after the cannibal guy. And his army of clones. You know, we could almost say that this is a clone war. And we're being attacked by these clones. In fact, you could almost say that this is very similar to George Lucas's Attack of the Clo- Wait, no. Never mind. Righto. Cutscene, I assume? I've been missing cutscenes. Oh! He's alive. Should I call in a medevac? He doesn't appear to be injured. Although I don't know uh, how he survived. It's called plot armor. Head later. I'm reading Fettel's transmitter near that position. We gotta take that fucker out. Fast. Jet, keep looking for Jankowski. I'm still reading his life sign. <laughs> you can't send him in alone? That's crazy. Jankowski's dead. Take care of himself. Now move! Dude, I can take care of myself. I am the protagonist, after all. You're lucky to be alive. You're lucky to be alive, too. I don't usually let NPCs live who talk to me to my face. Or better yet, to my phase. Ooh! Civilization! Civilization! Right. There's a grate, and one of these things. They killed the garbage man. Now this place is gonna reek to high heavens. I doubt that will be a sequel. They're overusing the dripping blood mechanic. Do it every now and again. Not like every other level. Or rather, every level. And cha. Helicopters. Apparently they're going off to go see Fear 2 Project Origin. I don't blame him. Seeing where the game is going might be helpful. You know, know if you survive to the sequel. Oh, cool. Call. You have one new message. Mike, what the hell is going on over there? It sounded like an explosion. I can't get through to anybody. Call me back. Sir, I assume that Mike will not be calling you back, but I cannot make any promises. Mostly considering I have no idea who Mike is. Let me guess, this door is... Of course, blocked. Don't you love it when everyone seems to put things in your way? Block doors for no reason. Although, I guess there might be survivors there. But, you know, they should mention that. Explain why things don't make any sense logistically. Alright, looks like we're about to go down into the depths of hell itself. And that's my cue to say goodbye. See you next time, guys. This is FaZe, Let's Playing Fear. Bye-bye.